हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम इन दिस लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट अल्फा बीटा प्रोनिंग राइट सो व्हाट इज अल्फा बीटा प्रोनिंग इट इज बेसिकली यूज इन गेम प्लेइंग विद द हेल्प ऑफ आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस व्हिच यू माइट गाइस हैव प्लेड सो व्हाट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज दैट वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू सॉल्व इट और सो इन दिस वी हैव टू बी डीलिंग विथ अल्फा एंड बीटा वैल्यूज so here i have written that alpha is equal to minus infinity and beta is equal to infinity so let us understand why uh, alpha we can consider it as maximizer node and beta we can consider it as minimizer node we have also uh, differentiated it as the square box and circle so it is maximizer and it is minimizer all right now uh, why we have taken alpha as minus infinity so as i told you that i alpha stands for maximizer node so we have here taken the worst cases of maximizer and minimizer nodes so for maximizer if we take minus infinity as the pilot value then to upgrade from minus infinity to positive infinity where wheresoever uh you would be dealing with high contingencies right and similarly in beta if you beta we have to minimize the value so if you start minimizing from infinity positive infinity you would be facing much more difficulties and much more time all right so this was the reason why we are taking alpha is in minus infinity and beta is infinity so we just have to start traversing it uh as we all know that in alpha beta pruning uh we follow a uh, breadth first search uh so we would be following this path all right so uh iterating this downstairs again here and here alpha is minus infinity and beta is infinity right so here in this we are having only single value single bubble or minimizer node that is 6 so we will be writing 6 over here now we have to traverse it over here so here we are having a maximizer node it means that we have to change the value of alpha so which one is greater between minus infinity and 6 but obviously 6 so we would be cutting minus infinity and we would be writing it as 6 and 6 will be written as here now 6 is over here so we have to traverse it back now here we are dealing with minimizer node right so which one is minim minimum between beta that is uh, infinity and 6 but obviously 6 so here we would be cutting the infinity and beta is equal to 6 all right now we would be taking this value as downstairs so alpha is equal to minus infinity and beta is equal to 6 now here 4 so is 4 greater than minus infinity yes so we would be cutting minus infinity and we would be writing 4 now 5 is 5 greater than 4 yes because alpha is a maximizer node and we have to select maximum nodes so 5 is greater than 4 yes so cut 4 and write 5 8 yes 8 is again bigger than 5 so cut 5 and write 8 now 3 uh, no so 3 is not bigger but whenever uh, the one more important rule in alpha beta pruning is that we have to take care about the relation alpha greater than equal to beta whenever you find this sort of relation while performing the alpha beta pruning you have to cut the remaining nodes you do not need to traverse that all right so here we got alpha as 8 and beta is 6 which is alpha greater than equal to 6 uh, alpha greater than equal to beta sorry so we would not be dealing uh, and we would not be traversing the another node so we would be just providing a cut over cut over, over here right so now the values uh here that is maximum which is 8 now we have again to traverse it back uh to minimizer node so here beta value is 6 and uh, here we have 8 so which one is minimum 6 so we would not be uh, changing it we would be keeping beta as it is all right so now let us traverse it again so alpha is equal to minus infinity beta is equal to 6 now uh alpha is equal to minus infinity beta is equal to 6 all right so let us start traversing again it downstairs so first value is 2 all right so uh first value is 
Now, is 2 greater than minus infinity? Yes. So, cut minus infinity and write 2 over here. Now, 4. Is 4 greater than 2? Yes. So, cut 2, write 4. Now, another one is 7. Is 7 greater? Yes, 7. Now, again, guys, uh, you could see that alpha value again became greater than beta value so we again have to provide a cut and we did not uh, we need not need to traverse the remaining node so here we would be providing a cut and here the greatest value will become as 7 now we have to traverse it to minimizer node so minimizer value is 6 and we have to uh, deal it with 6 either 6 or 7 so which one is minimum 6 again so no need to change it keep it 6 as it is now uh, we would be writing 6 over here right so we have to traverse this 6 over here which is again a maximizer node so we would be changing the value of alpha so minus infinity is greater or 6 but obviously 6 so cut minus infinity and write 6 over here now follow through this value downstairs so alpha is 6 beta is infinity alpha is 6 beta is infinity Now here 8 is the only single value so we will be writing it as 8 over here and as it is a maximizer node we would be changing the alpha value so is 6 greater or 8 but obviously 8 so we wrote 8 over here alright now uh, what is the value of uh, I mean we have to traverse it again over here so alpha is equal to 6 and beta is equal to infinity right so here which one is the maximum of all the four value or digit number four right but is digit number four greater than alpha that is equal to six because here we have to change the maximizer node no six is only greater so we did not need to uh, cut the value six and write four all right so six will be remaining as it is now traverse it back as here it is the minimizer node so we would be checking which one is minimum from 8 and 4 but obviously 4 so we would be traversing 4 to the beta value now again beta is equal to infinity so which one is minimum between infinity and 4 4 so cut the infinity value and write beta equal to 4 now as you all can again see that we are dealing with the rule that is alpha is greater than equal to beta so whenever this situation arises we do not traverse to the next node so which means that we have to cut this node right we did we need not need to travel traverse this uh, leaf all right so now let us move further so using the similar method i directly solved uh, this uh, node over here so it was having the value as 3 right so it is the single value so we have to shift it and as it is the maximizer so we would be trying changing alpha but 6 is greater than 3 so we kept 6 as it is and uh, now uh, we traversed it over here so 3 so we would be changing the value of beta over here but obviously so 3 is minimum than infinity so yes we wrote uh, beta is equal to 3 now again you can check that alpha is greater than equal to beta over here so we need not need to traverse the remaining nodes so we just apply a cut over here now what confusion maximum number of students have is that which cut are considered as alpha cut and which cut are considered as beta cut so let us clear your doubt over here as you can see that here it is a minimizer node which is be, which we consider at beta right so the cut above this circle value would be considering as beta cut check over here it is a circle which is a minimizer node which is a beta value so cut above beta value is beta cut right so over here we are just having two cuts now let us move over here now here there is a maximizer node maximizer value which means alpha so cut above alpha is considered as alpha cut just keep this in mind you will never get confused right so these two are again alpha cuts because uh, they both are these both cuts are above the maximizer value so it both of these values are alpha cut 
now many a times uh, you would be asked that uh, count the number of shallow cut and deep cut all right sometimes uh, these two values could be asked that what is a shallow cut i mean how many number are how many number of shallow cuts are there and how many number of deep cuts cuts are there in your alpha beta pruning example so for deep cut let me tell you that all the cuts that are available in these leaf nodes that is this minimizer uh, it is not every time there would be minimizer node so keep it in mind that the last nodes that are the leaf nodes so cuts available in the leaf nodes are considered as deep cut so how many cut and what kind of cuts are we are having in the uh, leaves so that is 1 and 2 beta cut so we'll be writing 2 beta cuts and shallow cut so that is all the other cuts uh, then the deep uh, then the leaf cuts are considered as shallow cut so these values would be considered as uh, shallow cut so we are having 1 2 and 3 alpha cut so shallow cut contains 3 alpha cuts all right so this was all about alpha beta pruning alpha cut beta cut and what is shallow cut and deep cut thank you